Forwards for Minecraft is a pretty good mod loader with relatively few errors, but they do sometimes show up randomly. My name is Adullah, you're watching Galera Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can fix Forwards black screen issues when playing Minecraft. Now the first thing that we need to do here is to update the Java file required to, for Forge to run. Now to do this, head over to the installations section and in front of Forge, go ahead and click these three dots and then edit. Now we're going to expand the more options section and uh, in the Java executable field, click on browse. Now what we're going to do is we're going to where we've installed our Java files and we're going to find uh, the latest javac file that we need to function or that minecraft needs to run so if you scroll down in this list you should be seeing uh, something called javaw.exe go ahead and select this file click on open that will get your uh, javac version up and running and then you can come here and click on save and this will hopefully fix the problem that you're trying to face. If that issue doesn't work out very well for you, what you can do is create an entirely new force installation which might fix your problem. How to do that? Well, head over to the installations tab, click on the new installations button and type out a name for your installation. So I'm just going to type in test minecraft forge. Uh, you can select a logo if you want and then uh, in the version section i'm going to select the latest forge installation that i have which is 1.21.4 and forge version 54.1.3 and uh, that is pretty much it you can go ahead and add your java executable like we did in the last step here but everything pretty much else should work fine so if you go ahead and click on install uh, this will tell you that you're going to play a Minecraft Java Edition game that has been modified and this should boot up Forge for you once again which means you can transfer any mods that might not carry over and get going. Last but not least, if uh, nothing else works for you so far, what you can do is try and create a new vanilla Minecraft installation and then reinstall Forge to it. So if you want, you can go ahead and delete your Forge installation, but I'm just going to go ahead with a new vanilla installation in this case, which is going to be clicking on new installation, naming it um, whatever you want, selecting the latest release, which in this case is 1.21.5. And uh, if you want, you can change the game directory, resolution and the other options here as well. In any case, go ahead and click on install and you will see that this waiting for install button will appear right here and your test minecraft installation would be up and running as you can see it's downloading so once it's finished downloading you can go ahead and launch this if this works then you're going to have to install fabric forge again for this particular installation and you should be good to go if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such videos can we make for you if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and if we cannot help you as much as we want through these videos do consider buying a membership and i'll see you in the next video